My name is Dylan Swoboda. I'm a precision ag specialist and product specialist here at True Ag and Turf here in Osmond. We work on planters quite a bit, set up planters, the new planters like this one here, or we'll do retrofits like the one over here. We also do GPS stuff where we install GPS solution for a customer. I just like to see farmers be able to perform at a high level. It's just kind of my favorite part of the job. We got to be able to maximize efficiency. So doing that, we have to have the best technology on the planter and be able to maximize each pass in the field. We want to be able to drop each kernel a certain distance apart. So we don't want to have skips where we go six inches without a seed. We want a seed every three inches and we don't want two seeds at one spot because then we compete for fertilizer and water. And we also have to keep consistent depth. So that's where the hydraulic downforce comes in. Because if we're off, you know, we have one seed planted at an inch and a half, another seed planted at two inches, well the seed at inch and a half might not be in any moisture, so it won't germinate. Therefore we have a dead spot there, therefore costing us yield. So we want to try to eliminate all those factors that we can control. Now we can't control the weather obviously, but we want to be able to control everything that we can to try to give that seed the best opportunity that they can. I grew up in Pierce, just south of Pierce, um, and then I went to Northeast for two years for the Precision Ag program. We learn about soils, we learn about nutrients, and then we finally get to the hardware. You have to know a lot about the soil and then fertility in order to get to what we can put on a planter to maximize those nutrients and what we can do with our soil so we can also maximize our yield. And that's where the Precision Ag comes into it all. Precision Ag will, in the future, will continue to grow. You know, we're losing acres, we're not gaining any acres, so we have to maximize every acre that we got the best that we can. We want to be able to maximize yield with lowering input costs so we have the highest profit margin. That's our whole goal in Precision Ag, is maximizing yield by lowering input costs so we're as efficient as we can.